Hi, Hello. I'm Kaylin Cushing. I'm Darren Childers. And this is our project, The Stunt Boss. <laughs> um, we built a toy car and we programmed it to be controlled by the buttons on the Nexus board to tell it to go forward, back, or spin right, or spin left. We also pre-programmed in shapes with the switches. So if you turn the first switch on, it'll do a circle. If you turn the second switch on, it'll figure eight. If you turn the third switch on, and you get a square. So, um, can I explain? Yeah, so the, the method behind the project is the controller board from the RF car is uh, right here. What we did is go through the scope and figure out what the car was actually getting from the remote. Um, and basically it was getting a series of six pulses. You can see the first five of the six on there. The first and last pulse turned out to just be an initiate and end for a control signal. Uh, and the middle four controlling what directions it goes. Um, so we went from there, figured out a way to adjust the clock frequency and the timing so that the circuit would output those pulses at the right width and the right spacing apart. Basically parallel to serial converting register outputs. Um, injecting those pulses back into this little board, uh, removing the components that did it automatically, generating those ourselves, and then the oscillator is excited and it transmits. Um, we programmed all that in PicoBlaze. The biggest challenge, I guess, programming-wise was the serial converter and getting all the timing right. Um, but yeah, we'll demo it. I'll start with the manual control demo. Um, getting the camera. And we've got, uh, what should be left turn and right turn, forward and back. And then we've got our automated signals to do things like um, turn left, circle left. Should do a little square. I'm going to move it a little more. Okay. And the little bumps in the carpet kind of mess up the shape, but. Is that a good battery? When we change the battery, like, um, the different kind of like the power, it different shapes. And then the third one is a figure eight, and because of the battery power variance, it kind of goes crazy. But if you can stay with it with the camera for a second, you'll we'll see it do basically figure eight. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's it. That's our project. All right.